I'm Leisha Ramstahl. I'm the Associate Director of Huron Pines and we're in southern Mount Morency County at Gilchrist Creek and Harwood Road where the Mount Morency County Road Commission just recently replaced this road stream crossing. Previously it was a set of tubes with concrete headwalls and the structure was constricting flow on the river. There was also some sediment coming into the river system from the crossing. So these are the types of projects that we do across Northeast Michigan to help improve the connectivity of the river systems while also helping to reduce sediment and make the crossings safer. It also helps reduce maintenance costs for the road commission as well. This was a project that was funded by NOAA through the Great Lakes Restoration Initiative, the Walters Family Foundation, Great Lakes Fishery Trust, and U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service. So partners like that like to invest in long-term improvements to the river health. And by doing road stream crossing projects, you're improving the resiliency of the river system by being able to connect the upper part of the river with the lower part of the river. So when we do road crossing replacements, we really try to pick a design um, and pick a size large enough that the river wouldn't even know that there's a road above it. Um, we really wanna recreate as best as we can, mimic that natural stream flow. We chose a timber bridge for this site for a couple of different reasons. We're in a very rural area, so the look and the feel of the timber structure is really nice for this site. Once you get into larger road stream crossings, timber structures are really good for that. You can build the piles outside of the stream channel and then you don't have any type of structure or barrier within the stream. The Thunder Bay watershed, it's not as cold or as clear as some of its neighbors like the asable or the pigeon or the sturgeon, which is why we're really focusing this project on Hunt and Gilchrist Creek because these tributaries are the, the coldest and clearest and it's a great place for the integrity of the watershed. Mount Morency County over the years have, have been great partners. They understand the value that these projects have and we wouldn't be able to do this type of work without their investment. This is a prefab timber bridge that came to the site and it looks like a big pile of Lincoln logs. And so then the Road Commission will take that and fit it together and then you get this beautiful structure that will, you know, be here for the next 50 or 60 years.